Ayam Kijo, the Assistant Director of Academic Affairs at the CMA. What's been on my mind is the nature of solitude. I live alone and Huey Lee Smith's rooftop from 1957 has come to mind again and again, both for its vision of isolation, but more for its ability to inspire in me a contemplation of stillness. Painted in 1957, the artist rendered a representation of urban isolation through a subtle color palette, a single figure, and a vast sky. Lee Smith was often contemplating loneliness born of racial and economic disenfranchisement. On the brick building, we see evidence of financial insecurity expressed in the areas of patched concrete used instead of the more expensive masonry, which would have required a craftsman to repair. A solitary figure stands with a relaxed posture, simply attired in a white tee and charcoal trousers. However, he doesn't meet our gaze. The figure's attention is instead drawn to a collection of other rooftops. Above, two cumulus clouds hover in a tranquil sky. Rooftop is an expression of Lee Smith's reflections on the stakes of being black and poor in American cities, both painful and personal to him. By 1957, he was teaching, showing, and selling his artwork in galleries but he had spent a decade working in Ford Motor Company manufacturing plant during Detroit's slow industrial decline. He witnessed the social and financial constraints placed on African Americans through two world wars and the depression. As our eyes drift from the bottom of the composition to the top, we see Lee Smith's handling of the pigment. We see the shape and intensity of his brushstrokes that change across the surface of the painting. On its face, this is a quiet arrangement of shapes and hues. But if we focus on the brick and sky surrounding the figure, we see the energetic brushwork that supports the overall stillness. In the brick, we find tightly articulated strokes defining the masonry. Yet the cream pediment separating the figure and brick wall introduces soft, loose, upward flicks of pale paint that blend into a similarly colored sky. And the figure, who from afar appears hastily painted, betrays a variety of stroke weights and color values when viewed more closely. The contrast between the cool silence of the painting and the energy of the brushstrokes is an apt metaphor for the frenzied thoughts and emotions contained in a single person. It's as though each daub of paint marks a moment in the complex world we each carry within ourselves. Looking this closely, I think of the activity that produced this study, done mostly in the solitude of Lee Smith's own studio. I imagine the artist transforming idea into reality in ways similar to my own, especially now as I close my second month at home where I've been engaged in many new projects. Each one begins with a deep internal investigation and a positive flurry of thoughts. In this, I feel an affinity for both the figure in this work, who, as he gazes upon the distant buildings, insists upon humanity's presence in those darkened windows, and with the artist who toiled in solitude to spark in us new thoughts. The circumstances of disenfranchisement that Huey Lee Smith is referencing in Rooftop still stand, as we're witnessing in the differential in health and economic outcomes for African Americans under the pandemic. I have to confess my privilege in living in a space that I love, that is both safe and secure, in having a position that will sustain me. I'm hoping that this little moment of what's been on my mind in this privilege of having stillness and the time to look will inspire you to spend some of your time alone discovering new possibilities or reflecting on history through art. To learn more about this painting, please visit www.cma.org. Be well.